on paper and certainly from the outside it looks like you're playing your best tennis certainly since since that Wimbledon 2013 is that how it feels to you as well yeah I, th I think so um, you know I just think overall that some periods last year I, I actually played some very good tennis but then physically didn't feel so good and then um, sometimes I felt like I was playing really well um, in matches for periods and then I would you know, lose that consistency and um, or that level, and I was just inconsistent. Um, you know, whereas now I feel like last few months consistently I've been playing well in, in all of the big events, and you know, hopefully um, that will stand me in good stead for the the grass court season. This event last year was the same with the first one that Amelie came to with you. Can you sort of give me a little assessment, a review of the last year with her, how it's been? Yeah, it's been good. I think the the first few months. Um, you know, weren't necessarily, it's not like it wasn't easy, but it's just that we didn't know each other at all. So that sort of transition um, period for when you start with, you know, a new coach, um, you know, it just takes time to get to know each other a little bit and the things that you you both like and exactly how to communicate with each other. So um, the first couple of months, you know, took a bit of time. But now, I mean, you know, we get on extremely well. Um, my results have been, been very good. I enjoy working with her and now, Obviously, with, with Jonas coming on board um, too, um, you know, it's going to be a, an exciting grass court season for all of us. And, um, yeah, hopefully it, it goes well. And you're here with Jonas this week. How's it gone? You've been working with him for a few weeks now. How's it gone? What do you feel he's bringing to your game? Yeah, I mean, we, we've... So we spent, like, the week in Munich um, was my first tournament with him. And I didn't necessarily play my best tennis there but I managed to, to win the event um, so that was you know a nice start um, for for both of us and then we spent four or five days on the grass now and um, you know the, the things that he did extremely well as a player and, and things that I think that I can really learn and benefit from with him are, you know he was a very aggressive returner and I think that that works extremely well on the grass courts um, he was very good up at the net um, you know, he's number one doubles player in the world um, and, and that's something that again you know if you can get yourself up to net and play aggressive tennis on the surface it can make a big difference so you know they're the things that I'm hoping that you know we can work on and that, that I can improve upon with with him and, and my team and we'll see how it goes.